I'm back. <laughs> oh yeah, what up you guys? Welcome back to another one of these videos. Man, it feels good to say that. <laughs> it feels so good to be back and making these videos again. Now, I wanted to make this video just to explain to you guys where have I been, because so many people have asked me, Lauri, where have you been? Did you stop juggling? Why aren't you making new videos? Uh, I want to explain where I've been, okay? So, short answer is I've been working, okay? I've been on a tour, performing. That's the short answer. But now let's go a little bit back more and explain actually where I was performing and how I ended up there. <laughs> um, and what is this place, by the way? So, like a year ago, one and a half years ago, I started to lose motivation to make new videos. I was still training a lot, like every weekday, from Monday to Friday, I was training. And, you know, the training hall that I was in had some construction working done. So I'd leave there and then we had the whole, like everything got cancelled, shows got cancelled, lockdowns, everything like that. So it was hard to find a place. I went to this CrossFit gym. I was, I paid them to go there for a few months. Then I got back here and then they had created some offices here. And I started to lose motivation to work at home. Like really, I couldn't do anything at home anymore. It was too familiar a place. It was too, I needed a change of scene. Okay, I needed a place of work. Like where can I actually physically go, do the work, then come home. So I wouldn't have to work at home as well. So at home, I can be with my family. I can enjoy myself. I don't have to think about work all the time. I love doing work. I love doing work but I also love to be with my family. So that was the way for me to get the motivation again, started working properly, and also to spend more time with my family, all right? So I got this place. This is my new office slash studio, and it's actually located in the training hall, okay? So when they made the renovations here, the constructions, they also built a few office rooms. So I got this last March, we made a deal with this, and yeah, I signed a contract from April to six months, like first, let's do six months. And I got everything ready here. So like after the first week of April, like 10th, 11th of April, I got everything ready. And I was like, all right, now I'm super happy. I have here like the backgrounds, furnitures. I have some, I have my props here. I put paintings on the wall, everything. I make it really nice. And then I have a lot of these noise canceling, echo canceling things, these acoustic foams and stuff like this. It's not perfect, but it's hell of a lot better, better than it used to be, right? Um, but yeah, so I got everything ready. I'm super excited. And by the way, if you want to see a tour of this place, like everything that is in here in the training hall and everything, it's located in Finland um, where I live. Yeah, it's like one, one kilometer away from where I live as well, so it's pretty cool. <laughs> um, yeah, just let me know in the comments and I will do like an office tour, absolutely. But yeah, so I got this ready and I was like, all right, I'm super happy. I got everything ready. And exactly the same day that I got everything ready, I was shopping with my daughter after this <laughs> and I got a phone call. A very good friend of mine, a circus director called, can you come do a show? like a half a year tour, seven month tour. I was like, what? <laughs> I've, I've done two tours with this circus before in the past, 2019 and 2017. And we already had a contract of me coming there in the future, but not now. But there was one artist who canceled in the last minute. That this is three days before the premiere, right? So I got this call on Tuesday and on Friday they had premiere of the tour and then it's like, the tour starts and then it's a go time. So <laughs> he called me, is it possible to come? So I had like, all right, just give me a minute. I will call you soon. So I started thinking about it. I talked with my daughter, I called my girlfriend. Um, and we talked about, I called my whole family, like how is it possible, is it possible for me to go? I had my own shows like for the summer and everything. And yeah, so we made a deal. I come for five weeks and you have five weeks time to find a new artist okay so I'm gonna come there for five weeks and what I do there and this is the funniest thing you know I'm a juggler right and I also do magic but 
they already had a juggler in the show. So the guy who canceled was a Diablo artist. And I had to do a Diablo. No, I didn't have to. They asked me, can I do a Diablo? Because they already had one juggler. And I'm like, yeah, I can do a Diablo. <laughs> if you know me, I'm not a Diablo juggler. I don't do Diablo. But I do have like a whole family entertaining routine with Diablo. Like where I talk, it's sort of like comedy juggling, but with Diablo. I was like, I've always wanted to do that in traditional circus, you know? Like, normally it's only like clowns that talk in circuses, and obviously the ringmaster. But I was like, I've always wanted to do that because you don't know me, but most of my shows I do with talking. They're like entertainment shows, they're like these comedy shows. Uh, obviously, with high skill level. If you can, you do it. <laughs> but, anyways, um, yeah, so that's what I ended up doing there. So I did two acts. And I had two days to build these acts. So I had my Diablo act, and then I had a one magic trick, right? So it's the card trick, a card from mouth. I did that, and I do them both very well, and it's very fun for me. And the second part, I did my new whip chuckling act, and I juggled chainsaw. And normally I juggled three chainsaws, but now because it was such a short notice, and I hadn't had any training session with three. Last time I did three before this was a year ago because there were no shows. All the shows was canceled. So I didn't do any chainsaw juggling. So I only did one. Just because, you know, it's very heavy for your arms. I wanted to have that training session under there. And now I didn't. So I only did one. So I did the Diablo with the magic trick. And the second act was my three whip chuckling act, finishing with four. And then I juggled the chainsaw. So that was like my, yeah, my juggling acts there in the circus. And after a few weeks, we started to talk about the possibility of me going there, like staying the whole tour. Because I really love being there. I, it's a very good place. I love the owner, very nice people, everyone. So we made it possible. Uh, sometimes I needed to replace get someone to replace me because I have my own shows but yeah so I basically I went in a circus tour after two days of preparing <laughs> so I was like going from ah, I have my new office to I'm living in a caravan and doing a circus tour around Finland <laughs> but it was actually super amazing I got so much help from friends and family and uh, actually, like, my girlfriend is the whole reason I was able to do it. So, you know, if you're looking at this, thank you so much. I love you. All right? But, yeah. That's where I've been. So, I've been performing, and it's crazy hard. If you've ever been on a circus tour, with traditional circus, we basically had a tour that was almost every day, new place, new day. One day place, one day, one day, one day, like this. Not we stay in one place for three weeks and then we change. It's just one day, one day, one day, one day. Mostly like this. I think we did around we did we did around two hundred shows in like hundred and fifty different places, different cities. And this was in six and a half months. So yeah, it's pretty hardcore. <laughs> but yeah, now I'm back. I'm back here. I did get a minor minor injury in my arm, so I have to do some you no know, maintenance. I have to take care of my body. I have to do some exercises, stretching, all that kind of stuff to make it better again. And I have to take it easy with the training for a few weeks. But I can still make videos. But anyways, that's it. I'm back. If you have some questions, let me know. If you guys want to see a tour of the office, let me know. Now you know where I've been and why I haven't been posting videos. Well, actually, you don't know why I haven't been posting videos. The reason for that was before, no motivation, uh, no place to talk. That's why no tutorials. And on the tour, it was such a hard tour for me. And I didn't have a training place there. So it, I, I did have a training place, but it wasn't the kind of that I wanted. So I didn't train that much. And also, it was very, very hard for me physically, the whole tour. So. I didn't train that much. So that's why also I didn't I didn't train, so I didn't make videos. And yeah. Now I'm back.
now I can make videos. <laughs> so if you have some requests about some tutorials that you guys want to see, some videos that you want to see, let me know and I'll do my best. All right, that is it. Thank you so much for listening to this rambling talk. <laughs> thank you so much for watching and you know, thank you for all the support. Uh, you guys are the reason why I came back, why I continued to make these videos. So, you know, thank you. And I'll see you in the next video.